Hi, welcome to my slideshow on the creative process. The creative process has five parts. The project, brainstorming, rough drafts, selection and refinement, execution. Part 1, the project. A project can be many things from client work in the professional world or as a final cumulative assignment in education that covers specific skill sets or knowledge. Whether it's for a creative writing, science, or art, there is a process that takes you from the initial challenge to a final product. An example of a project may be a reflective self-portrait or visualizing poetry. These are just two examples. Part 2, Brainstorming. This is the rapid development of ideas. Take the topic of your assigned project and write down as many ideas as you can think of. You might want to sketch out specific ideas as they come to you. Don't be afraid to go back and reassess ideas or add to them. When you're brainstorming, it's important to get as many ideas down on paper. Even if they're bad ideas, you need to get them down, otherwise they'll stay in your head. Part 3. Rough Drafts These are small, quick sketches that visualize your ideas. Roughs are not meant to look nice. They are simple drawings to organize ideas on paper. Always include notes to look back on. At this point, you don't need to draw things accurately. That comes later. Take a minute to look at the rough drafts on the right. You'll see that they include notes, and nothing's really truly drawn out. Here's an example out of a sketchbook for a project. You'll see that two parts of it have been highlighted, which lead to the final project. Part 4, Selection and Refinement. This is when you pick one of your rough drafts to refine and flesh out. The rough is never the final look, but simply the launching point. Now is when you do your research, collect references, and begin to accurately render an illustration. This is an example of a reference board for illustrating. In this case, I'm drawing the symbol for cancer. This is going to be done for an astrological project. When you're drawing something, especially something that's unfamiliar, it's important to collect as many references as possible and to practice drawing that element over and over again. Selection refinement is when you prep for your final execution of your initial idea. Here's the result of initial idea. Part 5. Execution. This is when you create and fully realize your idea into a final product. How will you execute your project is up to you. Is it a painting, an illustration, a computer graphic? You decide based on the materials that you're going to use. Here's a couple of examples that have been finished. These are all final execution of initial idea.